Hello and welcome back to Everything Gaming uh, and today I'm bringing you a quick guide on how to win a Ken Blocked Monster Energy Race Suit. Now it's the main trial challenge which is a co-op championship and it wants you to use an A-Class Modern Muscle Car. Now the one I went with was the Monaro VXR uh, but any other Mustangs also fantastic choices. Uh, I have created a tune for it uh, and as you can see here it is four wheel drive. Um, now the reason for that is because most of the, all of these races in fact are cross country uh, and if you rear wheel drive it might be a bit trickier uh, as you'll struggle for grip and traction considering the fact that these are quite powerful muscle cars now of course it's on unbeatable driver guitars uh, that's automatic um, but you've got to remember you're as part of a team of six at the end of the day um, so it's not done on if you win the race you'll win the champ you'll win the the outfit it's done on if your team win uh, and how successful they are now i was quite lucky because the team i had were actually pretty good uh, minus a couple of twats um, who just thought it was all about them um, and that they would try and win the race themselves uh, in which a couple of them actually failed quite miserably um, but that's how it goes on Forza Online, unfortunately. It's just the way it is, uh, but for the most part, I was with fairly skilled drivers. Now, as I sh said before, it's where all of your team place, not necessarily yourself. Um, so, for instance, I did come in first in that race there, but my the rest of my team came literally second, third, fourth, and fifth, uh, and one was in last, but we still won overall on points by quite a margin. Um, so if you are in last place, but your team are doing well, uh, it doesn't matter. As long as they win, uh, you'll win it overall. That's all that matters. So even if you do finish in last place in all three races, you still have a chance of winning the actual outfit, which is the best thing about it. Uh, and like I said before, the reason I chose four-wheel drive uh, is because, as you can see, it's cross-country. So a lot of it is off-road, um, and it's a bit trickier. Now, these are just clips of all three of the races, um, but like I said, it was fairly easy because I had quite a good team, uh, and the Monaro is actually a pretty decent car, um, to be honest. Now, this last race is the only one that doesn't involve much off-road, and there's just little bits here and there. A um, little bit of payback there for something you did in an earlier race. Anyway, story for another day, um, but like I said, it's actually quite simple. Now, the one annoying thing about this race, I don't know if it's a glitch with this specific car or what, but as you can see here, there's a slight ramp there, um, and I'm not hitting the wall, I'm hitting the ramp, and it's incredibly frustrating. I was getting really pissed off. Um, luckily, I managed to pull back a few places in this race, but on the third lap, it happened again, uh, and I fell to further back in the pack. But again, as I said before, my team did quite well, uh, so we actually won. We won all three races, but all you have to do is actually win two of them, uh, and you'll win Ken Block Race Suit. Now, this has been available before, um, but of course, this is your second chance to get it. So when you've unlocked it, you just go over to your character customization, scroll all the way over to the right, uh, where it shows you all of your outfits, as it's an overall outfit. Uh, and then you can actually win the Ken Block Helmet by winning the playground games um seasonal challenge anyway guys i hope this video did help you out um i hope that you've all unlocked this suit and if you haven't before that you will now uh if you did enjoy this video and it helped you out please don't forget to drop a like and subscribe for more apart from that massive thank you all all the best and take care guys